Hey ladies, so I'm here for my 24 and 25th week update. This video is probably going to be short just because I'm running low on time and my battery is about to die. I just wanted to let you guys know that everything is going perfectly well. Um, I have found new ways to cope with my anxiety and I've been using a really um, awesome coloring book that Dave bought me. Um, and it's kind of funny because you would think coloring is kind of childish, but I still love to color. Um, and the coloring book that I got is geared towards more like adults or people that have um, like anxiety or that are stressed out. I'm actually going to show you guys the book here in just a second. Okay, so this is um, Creative Coloring Inspirations and this is by Design Originals. And um, I'm not sure, I don't remember what, oh. And this is the lady that created it, Valentina Harper. And it just has different like um, really detailed um, pages that you can color with quotes and they even have extra quotes on the side here and then some space down here that where you could write your own and here's another one so I've noticed that using that along with like relaxing mu music or meditation music has really really helped has really helped um, with anxiety and be able to focus and kind of get my mind off the anxious feelings um, that I've been having um, it's been really tough. I'm, I know a lot of it has to do with my fears um, and things like that. So um, on a more happier note, I have reached viability. I actually reached it at 24 weeks. Um, so that was like a huge weight and relief, relief lifted off of my shoulders um, to finally be at this point. I'm actually currently 26 weeks and one day, but um, at 24 weeks is when viability and basically that just means that if she were to be born at that point um, she would survive she would have a 60% chance of survival um, and now that I'm over that kind of hurdle I'm she has an even higher chance of survival so that makes me so so happy and just really thankful um, this pregnancy is going by so super fast and it kind of makes me sad because I know in the next, depending on what you count, third trimester, um, next week or when I turn 28 weeks, um, is considered the third trimester and just saying that kind of makes me kind of sad just because I feel like I haven't really had enough time to um, slow down and really enjoy this pregnancy just because we've been moving. Um, we're going to be moving again in a couple days. Um, so it's just, I kind of feel like I'm taking it for granted a little bit. Um, so I'm just going to try to slow down and just kind of, you know, soak up every little moment that I absolutely can in pregnancy and, um, yeah, so, um, as far as baby girl is doing, she is doing great. Um, her movements have been gotten so, so much stronger. Like, I can actually feel her poke out like a limb, um, like a little foot or knee or elbow or hand or whatever. Um, I can actually feel it, uh, feel her do that. And it was kind of funny because the other night I was laying, getting ready for bed, and um, I would put my hand on where I felt her move, and she'd kind of push my hand away, and then I'd move my hand, and then put my hand back down, and she'd push it away again. It was just kind of a really sweet bonding moment and just something that I, um, I really enjoyed. Dallas is definitely enjoying feeling her move. He, um, whenever he feels her move, he calls it giving uh, baby sister high fives. Um, so I thought that was really sweet. She also really likes music, we found out. Um, we went and seen Kelly Clarkson in concert, Dave and I did. Um, and she just moved the whole time. I, don't, I hope that means she likes it. I mean, I don't know. I'm also going to be doing a couple fun videos here soon. Um, as far as like baby buys and things that, um, that are pregnancy and baby related. Um, I am still open to video suggestions. So if you guys have anything that you want me to talk about or that you want to see let me know in the comments um, I do have kind of a list already of what people um, have requested but I have room for more um, I did say on my Facebook page that um, I'm going to be doing a lot of changes for, um, on this channel and as far as like my video quality and scheduling goes um, once we move and get settled into our new place so um, I just want to let you guys know that so you know that these videos aren't always going to be like this I'm sorry this video was so short and kind of just everywhere but like I said we're pretty crazy or it's been pretty crazy lately but I will have a list of upcoming videos um, that I will be filming at the end of this video so stay tuned for that um, in case you're interested in what's going to be coming up next 
um, and I will see you guys for my 26 and 27 week update. Review on the Pre Mama prenatal drink mix. They actually have two. They have the unflavored one and the flavored one. I'm doing the flavored one, which is kind of like an orange citrus flavor. They also have a fertility supplement and a um, breastfeeding supplement as well, and they're all drink mixes. Um, if you want to know how to win this, um, I'm going to be doing a giveaway for the next two weeks at next two weeks on my blog. You can check that out at www.momtopic.net. I will have a link for that down below as well. Um, for the rules, all you pretty much have to do is um, like this video, comment, and follow my blog by newsletter.